Hey guys, it's just a bit of a short one. Right, you've probably seen this in the last video. Now time to get these beds prepped. Didn't have time a couple of days ago, so better get it done now. There's all the sweet corn, everything's up back out. It's all gone. Some flowers are out. Just a bed of weeds. So, let's basically span you around. All these are coming out. Might get a quick dusting of a bit more compost and blood fish and bone. I think they can come out. That chive can get cut back. I think this can get a coat and things get planted in there as well. So, I'll come back to you soon. Sorry about my shadow. Here we go. This sweet on bed cleared out when you're in there now. This is the bed as well. Smash plant has come out. I've left a bit of chard in. This bed's done. And I've put it between the spring onions. And I just found them and pulled them back out. Not unless you pulled them out fully. So let's get some of these plants in. That is his bed now. It's got the new broccoli planted in. After needs gonna need a good water. And believe me, this cover is going over straight away tonight. And here now, this is where the sweet corn was. That's now replanted with Brussels sprouts. I need to get a cover over that ASAP before the pigeons eat it. Here is the Savoy cabbage. Once again, it's got lime in there, even though it's got the manure now. Just give it some more. And I had a little space here, so two going in there as well. I've left my chard in. But I've also got a little space. I'll put manure in there, I'll put manure between the spring onions. So, I've seen this stuff. Strulch. Straw mulch for organic garden with slug and snail deterrent. I think I definitely need it for these beds. Reduces weed growth, 95%. Retains moisture, enriches the soil. Flowers, shrubs, root, uh, fruits and vegetables. Lasts up to two years and it turns slugs and snails. Now this bag, one bag, is £10 odd. And it says it's only three square metres. So that might do most of my beds. But it'll be expensive if you have allotment. Believe me, very, very expensive. So I'm going to put it on that bed. Right, let's have a look at the back of this packaging. <sighs> There you go. Let me read through that. Manufactured in quite some quality wheat straw with added iron minerals. And it actually does state there, precaution, wear gloves when handling. Making trace, contact traces of iron. Well, yes, slug deterrent. Environmentally friendly. Oh, my shadow. That's not gonna matter. Let's see if I can shift out of the way. Reduces watering. That's the weed control. And this bag was, I think it was just under £11. So, it states wear gloves. <clears throat> so let's see. Yeah, let's see if you can see up there. It does smell. That's it. Now, I cover my potatoes with straw. I wonder if I could do it with the rest of the beds. It'd be a lot cheaper than buying this stuff. Anyway, let's put some on the beds. Put it on the plants. Or I could just literally lay it all over the place. So, let's have a look at it. Right. Let's get down here. This is the stroach. That's got an odd smell to it as well. Now, they recommend you put this in two inches thick. If you want to put this in two inches thick, this bed is eight foot by two foot, I think. This will use a whole whole bag. So, still a fair bit left. So, it's going on that bed. 
and let's go in. On that bed, if I have enough left. Right, that was a calm one. That's now got Brussels sprouts. And spoiled cabbages. And a little bit there. And that's all that's left, not the big bag. So, would be pretty expensive for an allotment. And that really is the only very thin over my beds. Right, as always, thanks for watching my channel. From a very sweaty leaf water. Give me thumbs up or thumbs down just for the algorithm of YouTube. Like the notification bell and subscribe if you really want to. Thanks for watching, and once again, bye bye for now.